what just happened? The entire city is destroyed. I can't believe I lost everything. Wait, what's that over there? Oh my gosh, a penny. Maybe I didn't lose everything after all. You know what? I'm gonna turn this penny into a billion dollars. I'm gonna rebuild my life, and it's all thanks to this penny. Ah, out of my way. Ah, it's mine now. Hey, what? That's mine. Finders keepers, idiot. Oh no, you don't. Ah! Oh, hey. Listen here, buddy. This penny is all that I have left. Hey, where's Gwen? I don't know, he ran over here. My friends are coming to help me. Looks like you're outnumbered. Oh no, I gotta get out of here. That storm took everything. All that's left is just a bunch of criminals. I need to get out of here so I can start my new life. All right, Nick, it's finally time to start over in a brand new city. Man, I'm exhausted from running away from those guys. Yo, Kevin, stop the car. Uh, what do you think you're doing here, man? Just walking. Yeah, well, this isn't a place for poor people to be hanging out, okay? Uh, yeah, you tell him, Kevin. I just told him, Jerry. Look, I'm starting my life over, all right? I came to the city to work hard and be a billionaire. Oh, yeah, all right, man. You'll never be a billionaire. Yeah, he looks so... You guys just shut up, okay? I have every right to be here. We don't want poor people in our town, okay? I bet you don't even have anything worth of value. Oh, yeah? Well, check this out. What is that? Dude, is is that a penny? It is a penny, actually. Whoa. Dude, I've never seen one in real life. I thought they didn't make them anymore. I thought they were just a myth. How much do you want for it? What? You want to buy this? Yeah, this will blow all of our rich friends' minds, dude. Uh, how about five bucks? Uh, yeah, sure thing. That's so cheap. Yeah, I blow my nose with five dollars. <laughs> this thing's probably worth a couple hundred. Um, it's only worth a penny. <laughs> yeah, right, dude. Whatever. Just shut up. We're not talking to you anyways. Come on, Jerry. All right, this is awesome. Now I've got five bucks. Oh man, I'm starving. I don't know how I'm gonna get anything to eat with just five bucks. I guess I could see if there's anything to eat out of the trash. I gotta do what I gotta do. Carl, you said you were gonna take these crates and get rid of them. Yeah, I will get rid of them. But first I want $10,000. $10,000? That's way too much. You can't pay it, I'm not getting rid of it. Uh, excuse me? What's going on over here? Uh, this doesn't concern you, poor broke idiot. Unless you want to fix a bunch of broken phones. Well, actually that sounds like something that I could totally help with. Wait, really? Because this bozo wants $10,000 to get rid of this stuff. Well, how about this? I'll buy them off you for five bucks. Yeah, totally. Sold. Wait, you gotta be kidding me. We had a deal, Donnie. Yeah, we had a deal until you raised the price, Carl. All these broken phones are yours. Awesome, thank you. The what? Some dumb poor idiot's gonna steal my business? This isn't gonna be the end of this, yeah, I promise yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Man. Drive away, Carl. Where's the five bucks, kid? Oh, right. Here you go. Excellent. Thanks for getting rid of these for me. What are you gonna do with a bunch of broken phones anyways? Well, I actually used to build electronics. So I could totally fix these up and sell them. Wait, really? Wow, that's kind of impressive. I'm going to turn these phones into a billion dollars. That way I can rebuild my hometown. Yeah, great idea. Look, it's good to dream big, kid, but get real, okay? Good luck with everything. And that's the last one. It was a pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, obviously. Thanks for the new phone, idiot. Well, I'm glad that you're happy with it. Have a great day. Gotta go text my friends. Hey, Uni, what's up? <laughs> fat idiot. <laughs> Whoa, I can't believe I made $3,000 off of this. So I'm gonna take out the trash. Oh my gosh, <laughs> what are you doing? You don't have a permit to run this business here. So you're here. just gonna destroy my booth? Uh, not my problem. City hired me to remove this junk. This isn't junk. This is my business. From my perspective, this is nothing but junk. Just like you. Trash. Loser trash. Dude, just shut up. What's the matter with with you. What's the matter with me is what's the matter with you, huh? You stole my business from me. Look, it wasn't anything personal. I'm just... Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. Well, you weren't exactly being fair about you it. You don't need to be fair in business. You just gotta make money. You said it's not personal. Well, I'm making it personal. Why don't you yeah. just get lost, all right? Before I call the cops on you for loitering. Man, my first real food. Wait, who's that digging in the trash over there? Wait, is that Logan? Hey, Logan! Nick? Oh my gosh, wh what are you doing? I feel like I should be asking you that. What are you doing digging in the trash? Well, after the storm hit, I lost everything. I thought I was the only survivor too. A lot of people came into town and looted the place. They robbed what was left of my house and took everything from me. You too, huh? Man, I'm sorry to hear that. 
But look, I found a penny and I upgraded it to $3,000 already. What? No way. That's right. I want to turn it into a billion. That way I can go back and rebuild everything the way that it was. Wow, Nick. I'm really impressed. I'm lucky that you escaped. Yeah, and I'm glad to see you're okay too. Just can't believe no one came to help us. Well, if you want, you can come and have some food with me. Wait, really? You mean it? Of course. You and I could stick together. Oh, man. Nick, what is this place? Please don't tell me we have to stay here. Well, Logan, this is where we're going to start our business. Here? Really? Look, I know it's not much, but we got to start somewhere, right? Yeah, I guess you're right. I just never thought it'd be here. In this building, we're going to start building our own phones. I want to make them the best and the most affordable phones in the entire world. That's a really good idea. How are we going to do this? I mean, building phones and electronic stuff is super hard. Do you know what you're doing? Of course I know what I'm doing. We just have to get work on building the prototype. Yeah, I guess you're right, but I don't really know if I'm going to be a whole lot of help. I don't know anything about electronics. Don't worry, I can teach you everything I know. Well, that's good. I'm more than willing to learn, and I'll work super hard, I promise. That's exactly what I like to hear. Now let's get to work! Alright, it's time to test this new phone out. I hope this works. Well, it's ringing. Oh my gosh, it's those mine. Hello? Hey, Logan, it works. Oh, dude, this is awesome. I can't believe we made our own phones and they work totally fine. I know. This is the start of something incredible. Kind of sucks, though. We spent all of our money making these prototypes. Yeah, but don't you worry. We'll make more money. I know exactly who to talk to. Oh, really? Who? It's this guy I met. He works in this electronic store. He'll be the perfect one to talk to. Hey, 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 what are you doing here? Oh, great. Now there's two of you? Carl, what are you doing here? That's none of your business. What you got there, huh? You stole someone's cell phones? No, of course not. We made this phone. No, you didn't. You made nothing. You do nothing with your life. You need to leave us alone. Oh, yeah? Why should I listen to a poor, broke idiot, We're gonna huh? use these phones to become billionaires. Yeah, and we're gonna take care of people in need. Well, that's the dumbest idea I ever heard. Let's see how many people you can take care of with a busted phone. Huh? No! All our hard work, what's wrong with you? Oh, man. Nick, I think it's broken. I'm sure we can think of something. I just hope this thing works when we go to pitch it. All right, Nick. What did you want to talk to me about? Well, me and Logan have been working super, super hard on this amazing project, and it's finally time to show you what we've got. What the heck is this thing? Some kind of phone? That's right. It's the latest and greatest phone. We built it ourselves. Why don't you give it a shot? Uh, okay, sure. I mean, I like the design of this thing. Looks like it's got pretty good service. Really user-friendly. I like it. Really, Don? Do you mean it? Yeah, I don't lie, okay? This is like the best phone I've ever seen. I want to buy a bunch of these and start selling them in my store. Oh, no way. That's awesome. However, that's sort of the only phone we have right now. What do you mean it's the only phone you have? Well, we're going to need more materials and people to help build them. Right now, it's just Logan and I. Well, I can help you with that, no problem. You can? Yeah, here, I got uh, $50,000. $50,000? Oh my gosh, this is incredible. This will definitely get us started. Yeah, and I want to be an investor in this. You guys have made an incredible product, and I can see it making a whole lot of money. I want in. Man, Nick, look at all this. Can you believe it? It's only been three months, and our productivity is through the roof. Yeah, at this rate, we're going to become billionaires in no time. Oh, it's Don. Hey, man, what's up? Hey, Nick, I wanted to call and tell you some great news. Oh, yeah? Let's hear it. I got the phones into a bunch of stores now. We're going to get a check for 50 million dollars. Oh my gosh, that's insane. Thank you so much, Don. Yeah, no problem. I'll send the orders over right away. What's the big deal? He just got our phones into a bunch of new stores, and he said we're going to get a check for 50 million dollars, Logan. What? 50 million? Are you kidding? Yeah, it's really happening. Dude, we're really doing this. And imagine, all of this started with a penny. It's just crazy to think about. But we still have a bunch more stuff to do. But we will reach that goal of a billion dollars, I promise. Well, what do we do next? Well, Don's sending us that order. So we gotta get this shipment out as soon as possible. I cannot believe that stupid idiot is making millions of dollars off of my trash. Oh, I'm gonna make him pay. It's time to make this first delivery. Oh, no, the time! 
tires! Ah, let's see if we can get that delivery out now, loser. They're all gone! I'm stuck here now. Oh, man, this is terrible! There's no way I can make this delivery on time now. <laughs> Carl! Carl, you get back here! Sucks to suck! Carl! <laughs> you know what? I'm not gonna let Carl stop me. I'm gonna drive this truck no matter what! Well, Nick, you made it just in time. And luckily, I mean, look at your truck. This thing is beat up. What the heck? Yeah, don't worry about it. The important thing is that all the phones are here. Yeah, thank goodness. This is gonna be the best product ever. There's already so much hype about this new phone online. Oh, really? I haven't checked. Yeah, man, thanks again for all your hard work and your determination. You're gonna make us a whole lot of money. That's the goal. I'm gonna make a ton of money and give it back to my hometown. You're from that town that was destroyed, right? From that terrible storm? Yeah, that's right. But you know, I gotta say, what you're doing right now is amazing. A lot of people want to just get rich and keep it all to themselves. You actually want to give back to people. Absolutely. Well, with that being said, I gotta get going. It's time to keep making more phones. All right, man. See you later. See you later, Don. Whoa! Oh my gosh, what's going on? I, I don't know. I'll buy you an Uber home. Because, uh, man, that's gonna be a long walk. Gentlemen, I first want to start off by thanking you both for showing up to this meeting today. I know you're both incredibly busy. Well, of course. So, what do you want to talk about? Well, I'm extremely interested in buying into your company. Almost everybody has one of your phones now. And even my daughter wants one. Well, that's really exciting news. We're just glad people really like the product. And you're both very humble, which is what I like. Because I am not. <laughs> Listen, let's cut to the chase, okay? I want to offer you each a billion dollars. A billion dollars each? You both accept the offer? I'll have my assistant send over some paperwork and get this started right away. Uh, well, I accept. What about you, Nick? Absolutely, I accept. Thank you so much. Now, if you don't mind uh, getting out of here, I've got a whole lot more business to handle. Oh my gosh, Nick. We just got a billion dollars a piece. What did I hear you say? A billion dollars? Where is it? We just made a billion dollars a piece, but really, that's none of your business. Oh, really? Well, if I remember correctly, you started your business with my trash. You owe me. We don't owe you for a thing. Oh, yes, you do. Look, Carl, if you didn't try to rip off Don, then maybe you would have gotten these phones. But even still... You wouldn't have invented a new one on your own, so this has nothing to do with you. This all started because of me, and now you think you're better than me, huh? We don't think we're better than anybody else. That seems to be your mentality, not ours. You know what, Logan? We got a lot bigger things to worry about. Let's get out of here. Oh, don't worry. This isn't the last you'll see of me. I'll make sure of that. Nick, dude, look around. It took us a long time, but we rebuilt the city. Heard news that people that lived here before are gonna start coming back home. Really? Man, that's the best news I've heard. Move out of the way, losers. Come on, let's move. What the heck? Is that Carl? What are you doing here? Here to destroy all these homes. <laughs> you know I was supposed to be a billionaire, not you. Well, this happened because of all of our hard work. You don't know the first thing about hard work. Now get out of my city. 